Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Thanks for watching. Today's video, I'm doing my, my I'm doing my first update on my project polish. So unlike my other project pan projects where my update is um, monthly, since this are nail polishes, they take a longer time to be to see progress on. That's why I'm doing it every like 2.5 months. So anyway, let's begin. So these are now all of my nail polishes. Um, as I mentioned in my intro, I don't really wear nail polishes again. So the point of this um, project polish is just to be able to get some usage out of my um, nail polish before I declutter them. Since I since I only have this much, I didn't choose five. I just chose three. The ones that I chose were these three because I was um, really into like light pastels during. Um, last January. So the first one is this one. This is the Sally Hansen Lilac. And I've only used this around twice. I don't I just don't really wear a lot of nail polish. So I started with this one and now I am on this side. So this that's quite a progress considering I don't really wear nail polish. So I'm quite happy with the progress. And then this one I have more progress for the Sally Hansen in Royal Hue just because I also use this on my toenails. The, um, usually I just paint my nails because it's easier to clean, it's easier to remove. But for this, I for some reason, I, uh, I also painted my toenails which I, I normally don't. So I have a lot more progress for this. And then this is the this is my favorite. This is the Wet n Wild Private Viewing. And you can see that I just mainly use this on my nails, but I have so much progress. However, as much as I would like to use this up completely, the formula is already a bit sticky That to the point that when I paint my nails, it's a bit um, stingy. Um, it's, no, it's not stingy. It's, it's a bit stringy where if I open it, it's no longer like the usual formula. It has, it's, it's a bit dry already, so I'm not sure if you can see, but yeah and as much as i like this i as i mentioned i don't really wear nail polish a lot for me to buy something that will revive the formula of this one and besides this was too this is already too old so i really enjoyed this one but but i don't have a choice i need to declutter this because it just does not apply as go as well anymore so that leaves me to just having six nail polish for the next batch and right now, I feel a bit more like colorfully. <laughs> so I am gonna take this wet and wild through the grapevine. So this is just a purple. I don't know, is this a purple? I don't know. Yeah, anyway, this is just this purple color. That's This is one of... This is probably the, the most um, colorful in my collection right now. So... I'm going to use this for the summer. And then this one also, this is the Sally Hansen in so much fun. So it's so it's not it's not the same but it's this is more like a coral peach. So there. And then the third one I am debating between this orly this orly one and this I don't know the name it's covered by stickers oh no this is everything rosy and this is distress denim I didn't buy this one my mom bought it for me but she didn't like it so huh. I think I'd, I'd go for this distressed one just because um, I already have um, similar color family so if I add this one it's just they're all the same so just for variety's sake, I'm gonna add in this dress. So these are all of my selections for the um, for the second for the second round. I don't know when I'll be able to update it because it just depends. I update my nail polish supposedly every six weeks, but this got delayed because I just didn't see a lot of progress because I just don't wear nail polish a lot. But yeah, this one I'm starting with this level. This one, I'm here, and this one is brand new. It's only been used once by my mom, so it's 
I suffice it to say that it's around this level. So yeah, that's it guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you found this very short update helpful and fun. And I hope to see you on my next video. Bye guys.